you guys welcome back this is stephanie with right on's gift creations coming back with another video hey if you are new i invite you to please like share comment and subscribe to my video and if you are returning welcome back to my channel and if you wouldn't mind hey click that notification bell so to let you know that i'm uploading a brand new video for you to enjoy so with that spills over let's get into the video so um everybody's doing grill baskets of course because it's father's day um so i have made a concept as well so i want to show you what i put together mm, hold on i love cranberry juice hold on that's all it is is cranberry juice the wine will go in there later okay so just kidding no i'm not um anyway i created a wine basket so let me just um, angle the camera down so you can see this this is my concept okay if you can see that so what i have is uh, my concept on a grill basket for father's day i got the jim bean um, grill set it has the barbecue sauce the the brush the basing brush the tongs and a little shaker where you can put your seasonings in and just shake it over to the um, the product that you're using on the grill. I got this at Christmas sale um, this this last uh, last Christmas. Um, it was regular price fourteen ninety five. Um, I think fourteen ninety five or fourteen ninety seven. Um, but I got it for um, I think three dollars and fifty cents or three dollars and seventy five cents, something like that. Um, I had some more of these, but I use them for Valentine's Day, so for the men basket, so, and they sew very well, so hopefully next Christmas, I'm going to grab some more of these, you know, but I'm not going to pay the $14 or something, so I'm going to try to beat the crowd the day after Christmas, or a couple of days after Christmas, and get as many as you can, okay? Also, I have a meat cleaver in the back, a large meat cleaver. Um, a baster. Also, I have two towels that I got from the Dollar Tree. And I also, on the back, I have my backing that I use. As you see, here we go. This is my backing. I just took the same towel um, idea and just wrapped the backing up and it, so it can show in the back. Uh, grill, eat, and chill. Okay. Have my shred there. Okay. Turn it back around. I got two types of seasoning. I have a chili powder and a mesquite rub. So some good flavors there. In the middle here, I have, um, you get these two little packs for a dollar at Walmart. They have a section in Walmart now that shows those little small hot sauces and ketchups and, and different types of seasoning there. They are real small. And also, also they have these two packs, okay? This is the barbecue sauce, mild, and like a wing sauce, which is buffalo, butter buffalo. Okay, they're real tiny. I thought it was cute to fit right here in the middle. Okay, also have the shaker bottles I got from Walmart, 97 cents. Uh, the grill expert bottles that have been cute right here. I just put that here, just lay that across here. <clears throat> And I also have the oven mitt and the pot holder that matches the two um, kitchen towels um, in the front. And I'm using a red bucket, okay? So this is my um, easy concept for a grill basket. I'm gonna do some more of these. I just don't have any more of these, um, this set. So I'm gonna have to create a set that looks something like this um, and put it in my basket using a barbecue sauce, some tongs, some brushes, and I may not find a shaker, but I just use the rub instead, okay? So, so this is this concept here, and I'm gonna wrap it up and put a bow on it, of course, and I already made a bow. So this is my bow with the center, center loop, and I'm gonna show you guys how to make it, which is really simple. Um, I use the Easy Bow Maker to make my bows, okay? And it's gonna go right on the top once I wrap it. I'm gonna wrap it in um, using a 32 by 40 
shrink wrap bags I get from Amazon, the Perfect Q, um, 32 by 40 shrink wrap, and just wrap it up. I probably put it at the top, or I might put the bag over the ba the basket here, add a strip like like here. So this is the ribbon I use. I get from Hobby Lobby. This is the Robert Stanley collection. And I probably, once I wrap it, I will bow it up here, like so. And just add the bow at the top like that. Okay? That's what I'll probably do with this one. I'm sure I will. But that's gonna be a cute, cute look. Okay, this is a nice satin floor ribbon. Um, again, you can get from Hobby Lobby or any floor store that you use, Michaels or whatever. I don't go to Michaels much. Um, I think I've only been to Michaels maybe three times in my life because I like Hobby Lobby better. Okay, so yeah, this is this is the ribbon I'm using. So if you if you ever, I'm gonna do probably do a video on it, but it's real simple. All it is is just gonna. I use my Easy Bow Maker right here. Of course, everyone is probably using the uh, Bow Dabber, which is my girl, uh, Lady Die. She's the Bow Dabber Queen, honey. Bow Dabber Queen. Well, honey, go ahead on, girl. But I'm just going to stick to my Easy Bow like she's, you know, she's tell you guys I have. So what I do is once you, let me, let me arrow down here. Not arrow down. Bring the camera down. So once you make all your bows going like this, you're just going to do a half bow in the center. So you're just going to put it through the, the pegs. Make sure I have it. This is your spool holder. Once you have all your ribbon, you have how many loops that you want to use. Um, this is a two point two and a half inch ribbon. Now you can do the one and a half, but I like using my center bow with a two point five. Uh, wide. Okay, just gonna put it in here in your easy bow or your bow dabber, and all I did was do a half a bow, a half a, a half a loop, and that's it. And that's all you're doing. You're gonna put your your zip ties or whatever you use, and that's it. All your bows is gonna be here. All your ribbon and bows have you made them right here. You're gonna take this, take this one strip. Put it into your gadgets that you're using and make a a center loop and you're going to pull a little bit so you want it to be small okay and you're going to take all your ribbon up and along with the center loop and there you go that is called a half bow okay and that's it Okay. But I can do a new video um, showing you the complete look. But yeah, this is mine. I use um, a black and red polka dot I got from Amazon. Okay, the satin ribbon, floor ribbon I got from um, hold on. the black and red um, fabric from um, Amazon, the satin floor ribbon from Hobby Lobby, and the candy stripe ribbon from Hobby Lobby. And just made a quick bow, and that's it. Simple, easy to the point. Again, like I always tell you guys, I'm going to wrap it up, bow it up, and send it out the door. So tell me what you think about this basket. This is my version of uh, the Grill, Bas Grill Master Basket um, for Father's Day. So, again, you guys, thank you for watching. Please like, share, comment, and subscribe. And I hope to see you again in the next video. Bye-bye.